I've been waiting for you, Jan Sauer. Hey, that's... Voyager! I was certain you'd come here. What's going on? What's he got to do with this place? This is where he killed my wife and child. Uh. Voyager, I'm already dead. Whatever you're scheming in this place means nothing. No, you're still suffering, even now, aren't you? Time stopped for you on that day. You can never escape from it. If you'd heeded my warning and became a testament together with me, you wouldn't have had to suffer like that. See, a testament? Why are you so surprised? The same applies to all of you. You. You and you. All of you possess the characteristics to become one of us. He knows that and has been observing you all this time. He? Observing what? Yes, he planted an observational program in a special realian. Didn't you notice him standing by and watching you for 15 years? Program came in. Or perhaps I should say, Lactus. Lactus? That's impossible. That was 100 years ago. <laughs> Kanan! It's you? You're that Lactus? Codename Lactus. I was given that name 100 years ago to observe both Voyager and you, Captain. And now, I am observing all of you, Rubido. Kanan is an observer? Kanan, you're kidding, right? There's no way you'd be a spy! Rubido, what he says is true. That's how I'm programmed. Kanan, you've been betraying us this whole time? Say something! Answer me, Kanan! Don't be so hard on Lactus. That's what he was made for. Just as you were created to be a weapon, he was created to be an observer. I'm sorry, Rubido. Kanan! Enough of this, Voyager. Why are you doing this? What's the point in making Lactus suffer now? Captain, is this why you became a testament? What's your real objective? Answer me, Eric. <laughs> I became a testament to escape the fear of death and to obtain eternal pleasure. It had nothing to do with you, Gion Sauer. The reason I concern myself with you is extremely simple. I just want to enjoy my eternal life along with you.